all the targets I go to, same cars. Been a couple months now, same cars. They must have got pallets of this uh, case code. I didn't look on the back. But at least they got this new 5-pack up here. Yeah, buddy, attack pack, 5-pack. Got a couple models I want to check out. Here we got the Monster Jam, got the dual packs. Some other uh, vehicle stuff. The Disney Pixar car section has been uh, whittled down. It's not so big as it used to be. It used to be half the aisle practically. Here's some new singles. Not new singles. The new packages. I already got this guy, so I'll go ahead and leave them for somebody else. Sure enough, in the back, our old buddy Finn McMissile in the old package. Still hanging around. How many did Mattel make? Did they make enough for one person and every person in the United States is supposed to buy a Finn McMissile? Oh, yep, look, pink stuff. That's what our Target stores look like. Unfortunately, we don't even get a whole aisle of die cast anymore. Ooh, there's a bat. I opened up my other one, so I'm glad to get this one, so I have one in the package now. Attack Pack 5 Pack. When I first seen this one on, I think I seen it on uh, Diecast TV channel's video uh, a couple weeks ago. They got it before we did down there in Australia. Of course, uh, I was looking right at these two fellas right here. Got the accelerators models. Is that hair inside or outside? Hey, that's inside. It's not mine. You know that. But uh, there you got Jack Hammer. And one of my top uh, favorite collecting models, Spine Buster. So we got five, got five models in the pack. Two of my favorites. You got the Jack Hammer. You got uh, Spine Jack Hammer, Spine Buster. Oh yeah, got the guy with the bus out. But what's the deal with this uh, pinkish color here? Come on, man. What'd you do? Get the guy from uh, Matchbox to come over and uh, do some colors. It's a fun model, but mm, I don't know about the color. So then we got uh, Berserk with this blade. Up top we got the, another funny coloration. Come on, man. Bad Mudder. There's Bad Mudder. And of course we got the uh, Moto Blade, which was just in the uh, Team Hot Wheels. I just showed you those videos. That's an alright car. Moto Blade. Check, 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 Moto Blade, Moto Blade, Blade Runner, what? What is going on here? I lost him, there he is. So here you got the Moto Blade. What happened? What happened to the name, Moto Blade? As a matter of fact, here on the side you can see the stack. I'm getting ready to do my uh, Track Stars 2012 review. I got Moto Blade. In here somewhere. Look, there he is, Moto Blade. Here's the one that I opened up from the uh, Team Hot Wheels, a five pack with the DVD. There's Moto Blade. Right on the base, Moto Blade. Looks like we got another uh, new name for a uh, Hot Wheel. We're gonna have to open it up. See what it see what it says on the base. I just noticed on the package of my uh, Skybusters. The uh, MBX Skybusters, the bat, it's got the 60th logo up there in the corner, so they must be repacked. I gotta, I gotta check my other video, or maybe I'll put a link and see what, uh, I don't think the other one had that logo, so it's nice to see it reissued. I'm glad that uh, I was able to get one for the pile, so now I gotta have one in the package, because I already opened up my other one to show the uh, comparison. Let's get right to the story first, and then we'll uh, go ahead and put some cars on the turntable. Uh, let's see, on the back of the pack, I know some of you guys like to see the back. Oh, I already did. I already showed you, but I'll pause this so you can uh, read that. I think that's just generic what they're putting. And then they got the retroactive. Kind of interesting, they got the, yeah, yeah, uh, Imagination Series, that's right. And then that dinosaur guy. Can't think of his name real quick. But let's go ahead. Moto Blade, Moto Blade, looks the same at first glance, I don't think they changed anything on the uh, casting, here we go, ready, we're going to see. find out at the same time, Do -do -do. a little too high, Pew, 
beep, 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 beep. Here we go. Now let's see. The other one had the name uh, right there. Moto Blade. Here he comes. Ta-da! Moto Blade. So why did they put on the back of the package? They put uh, Blade Racer. Hmm. Very strange. I thought it was going to be kind of a uh, fun uh, kapow video, and it wound up being uh, kapow. Oh, well. There you go. Moto Blade. Great track. Does he have the loop? Works in the uh, boosters, loops, and curves. The only thing is that this this thing pops off real easy. I used to buy them to use for my parties, but then I got tired of it because then I'd always have to have to fix that. Uh, as a matter of fact, I wouldn't even use I wouldn't even use this. Once this thing pops off, I just throw it in the trash. I don't even use it. Here we go. Buzzer. See? Look, pick them up and it come right off already. Let's see. Check out Berserk. He's got that little uh, turbine. Wait, hold on. Let's do it right here. It's a little high up. If you're on carpet, if you're on carpet, for sure that thing turns real good. There's Berserk. Odd colors. Fellas, save the best two for last. Uh oh, Bad Mudder, he's gonna block my view. Actually, I did that wrong. Now we got uh, Bad Mudder, odd colors again, and the best two in the pack for me. You got Jack Hammer with that uh, whisker. You know how they always let that one hair grow off of their. Uh, their chin or off their cheek they got that one hair what is that man just would you cut that thing uh oh bad mother he's bad he fell down he's gonna be too tall anyways he was gonna block the camera jack hammer that's a pork chops vehicle from the accelerators so you accelerators fans who like to pick up the recolors of the accelerators models there you got jack hammer and right now I'm just kind of a checking out my my awesome spine buster. Okay, I'll share. I'll let you see too. One of my uh, top three vehicles that I love. Spine buster. Just looks mean, man. Mean, look like he'd be really fast. So there you go. There's a look at the attack pack, the 2013 attack pack. It's 2012 copyright on the box, but 2013 release, I assume. And, uh,. There's a look at the uh, five models, two Accelerators models. I'm sure there'll be some Accelerators fans that are going to pick up this five-pack. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.